Uh, good, good evening, and thanks for being here. Um, no matter how many times I have to introduce the film, I get incredibly nervous. I don't know why. It's just stage fright, I guess. But uh, while you're watching the film, um, I am going to get a drink or two in order to properly prepare for the Q&A. So I promise to be adequate when I return for the Q&A. Uh, also, I would like to thank the festival uh, for inviting Ave and uh, Dimitris in particular. It's an honor and privilege to be here. Thank you very much. Well, in in case of in case of Ave, um, the re the reason why why she is lying is that's the only way um, for her to protect her fragility and vulnerability. Um, and for me, that springs from the family dynamics. Even for the glimpse that we have from the uh, from the family uh, from Ave's family in the hospital, I hope we understand that we have a, a vacant an absent father who is ready to send a car to pick her up but there's like really no emotion you have a really dominant mother who controls the the family so for Ave that was in my opinion the only way to preserve her sensitivity and fragility um, I wanted to have two very different characters on the opposite side of the spectrum as far as uh, uh, what what truth is and uh, where lies enter. And in the case of, of Kamen, he is more of the catch and the right character, which no matter what the consequences of him telling the truth the way he understands it, he is compelled to act upon it. And he doesn't actually believe in lying until the very last scene uh, where we see him telling his first lie. Um, not, not at all. Actually, the real girl that inspired the character was called Ave, short of Avelina. And uh, when I was working on the script, I had her as Ave, and it stuck, and it has no other meaning but the uh, name of the girl. <laughs>